The AMZ Zuber forms a necessary addition to the reach of the modern Polish army. The Zuber design is centered around an agile, armored, multi-purpose, four-wheel chassis based on the locally produced Iveco Eurocargo vehicle and provides a robust and responsive solution to Polish mechanized forces. At its core, the Zuber is an armored car called upon to supply Polish armed elements with a do-everything platform in support of various army units. With deadly lessons learned across both Afghanistan and Iraq battlefields, the Polish army has supplied limited contingents to both coalition causes, the AMZ Zuber has been specifically designed to withstand blasts from IED, improvised explosive device, sources and hidden enemy pressure landmines. The AMZ Kutno concern of Poland is in the market of modifying existing vehicle systems to create a broad range of capable wheeled vehicles including civilian, police, general security and specialized military solutions. In AMZ nomenclature, the Zuber is classified as an armored transporter. Design-wise, the Zuber makes use of an all-wheel drive arrangement featuring four large rubber tires, two wheels, two a vehicle side. The setup of these wheels and chassis allows for excellent ground clearance and further enhances both cross-country travel and blast deflection from below. The latter is further helped by the V-shaped nature of the hull design which effectively spreads out the blast shockwave away from the centerline of the vehicle. The engine is conventionally fitted to the front of the vehicle with the passenger compartment located at center and rear. There are four automobile-style hinged doors, two to a side, depending on the variant in question. Each seating position is protected with thick glass vision panels while the sides of the vehicle are angled outward for basic ballistics deflection. A large tubular bumper system protects the front end of the vehicle from road obstacles and assists in ramming. A remote-controlled weapon station, when equipped, allowing for firing from inside the vehicle, is fitted atop the vehicle roof as are various equipment arrangements and mission gear. Typical armament is a 12.7mm heavy machine gun with complete elevation and traversal from its perched position and a 7.62mm machine gun and 30mm automatic grenade launcher figure into the mix. Overall armor protection is rated against heavy caliber arms up to 12.7mm, 0 0.50 caliber, as well as general protection against 7.62mm projectiles and artillery shell splinters. Its compact size also clears it for air transport in standard medium-sized military transport aircraft. Passenger capacity includes seating for up to 10 personnel in relative comfort. For smoke grenade dischargers, if equipped, mounted on the forward roof, provide some tactical protection. The Zuber is powered by a single N60 E NTCI Vico Tector Series 6-liter, six 6-cylinder six diesel fuel engine of 275 horsepower running at 2500 RPM. The power plant is mated to a 7-speed, 6-forward, 1-reverse, automatic transmission system. The vehicle is rated for a top speed of 62 miles per hour on roads, less off-road, with an operational range of 372 miles, under ideal circumstances. Ground clearance is 0.7 meters. The vehicle weighs in at 15,000 kilograms, 33,000 pounds, and features a running length of 6.45 meters with a height up to 2.65 meters. The Zubra is known under four distinct variants as of this writing. The base vehicle is Zubra, which is classified as an MRAP, Mine Resistant Ambush Protected, vehicle. The Zubra WD is the dedicated command vehicle with additional communications gear installed. The Zubra P has been developed as a mobile defense platform armed with ground, thunder, guided surface-to-air missile launchers, similar in scope and function to the Stinger-armed American Humvee system. The Zubra MMSR is a specialized surveillance platform fitted with the N26 series radar system to track aerial activity. All vehicles retain a general similarity in appearance. As of this writing, Poland remains the sole operator of the Zuber vehicle.